hello everyone my name is Hal and today we will see how to create updatable dashboard for updatable dashboard we required updatable PAQ and we know that we have created in the last video we have already created the updatable PAQ so we are going to use that BAQ to create updatable dashboard if you don't know what is updatable BAQ please check uh, my another video I have explained what is updatable BAQ and how to create link in the description so we will start this updatable dashboard but before we start we need to know what is the use of this updatable dashboard suppose user have to update the details about the customers on the daily basis or multiple customers on the daily basis what he will do he will go to the customer maintenance customer entry form and select the customers uh, one by one and change the description or whatever he want to change the details about that customer and then click on the save again search the another customer so for that we are we are creating the dashboard which is updatable dashboard and user can open the dashboard in once and update multiple customers and click on the save button it will save automatically into the database because of this dashboard user can save his own time and utilize that time into the another task rather than uh, spending time to just uh, doing the data entry so first we will see the updatable BAQ what result is coming in that BAQ so I have opened the previous my BAQ which is created already analyze analyze syntax is ok get list yes so this is the data is coming now I am fetching this data into the dash dashboard ok so go to the dashboard click on new so I am going to give the new ID for this dashboard so I am giving test update dashboard oh, db caption I will give the same copy paste copy paste all companies yes right click select new query here we need to search BAQ so ex update double click auto refresh on load ok yes click on ok button then we need to go to the summary click on right click on this summary and click on the prop properties button there is a button updatable this is most important thing we need to do in the updatable dashboard in simple dashboard we are not clicking on this button ok so this is the updatable dashboard so we need to click on this button ok updatable and it will show which column which field is going to update because we already specified in the BAQ which field is going to update if you want to see you can see into the BAQ ok I will go to the BAQ and I will show you so first I am going to give the prompt that it this should be user can update this one ok click on ok button now I am going to give the tracker for uh, filtering the data so clear uh, customer ID customer customer name one customer equals equals ok input prompt only and click on ok I'm going to design this dashboard for so this is a dashboard is created ok now I'm going to save this and deploy dashboard test application so here I can run the dashboard and I will show you that this is working and we can attach this dashboard into the menu maintenance so that user can use this dashboard okay so this is if you see this cancel underscore C column there is one row is customer ID is C triple zero five four okay I'm going to cl double click and uncheck this one okay and then click on save button it is saved and click on refresh button it will go okay so in database already updated and write off this uh, record that uh, cancel checkbox is false 
okay so this is uh, updatable dashboard which is same as a simple there is only one thing we have to click on that checkbox button that is updatable and we need to give to the fields which field is going to update and these fields I am showing you in the data in the BAQ also in BAQ we saw that in update tab there is uh, some fields which is coming which uh, we have selected and we give that these fields these fields only can update okay so we have given these two fields that's why it's coming there read only not read only form others are remaining in the read only form in the dashboard okay so this is the dashboard uh, which is uh, updatable dashboard we need to deploy this dashboard close this one I'm going to the dashboard go to the tools click on deploy dashboard button there is one checkbox deploy smart client application click on this button click on the deploy button after deploying this dashboard we need to go to the menu maintenance and attach the menu for this dashboard if you don't know how to create the menu there is another video for that menu maintenance how to create a menu how to deploy the dashboard or other form we can update that menu right so I'm giving that that uh, link also in the description okay I hope you understand thank you so much